Look at this, sunny 75 day. And we got a freshie. <laughs> oh, she's, she's close. That's fine. It's a work truck. <laughs> she likes to wheelie. Anyways, we're picking up another F-150. The jumper. What a beast. <laughs> Good thing I put my parking brake on. You can keep going, another foot or two. Keep going, keep going. That's good. That bumper's coming off anyway. <laughs> so this is the new track beast. We're just in forest here. Beautiful day. Oh, jeez. Oh, <laughs> uh, these fenders are screwed anyway. You excited to see this thing jumped? Damn right. <laughs> Uh, I haven't had an F-150 in a while. Missed the old, uh, we jumped that F-250 the one time. That thing flew. I don't know if you guys saw that, but she was pretty wild. How long you have this thing? Oh, a couple months. Oh, okay. Yeah, I didn't have it in a while. Oh, no, just the winter beater? Yeah. Nice. Well, hopefully she uh, she's high and let her fly. Oh, yeah. I think she'll do well. I'm just worried about that bumper. We'll rip that off right away. <laughs> Sweet. All right, we gotta load it up and get out of here. <laughs> yeah, this is for Brad. <laughs> I can't believe you're keying your own car. I don't want it anymore. <laughs> Some good old Ford paint. <laughs> That's hilarious. <laughs> So this Jeep, we jumped it the other day. Happy birthday, Thomas, by the way. Um, we had the minivan up top there. I'm just using this as my pointer here. You hold that. <laughs> we had the minivan up top and it cleared it by a mile. As you can see, it landed right there. But I have a feeling we can get this going again. I hope. We have to be able to get the hood open first. <laughs> that's, that's the first issue. <laughs> Look at this, all the steel in the back. Push the seats very forward. There you go. What are your thoughts? You think it'll start again? Probably. It's a Jeep. I know, it was trying to turn over, but uh, can you get her? She might be a little wedged in there. <laughs> it's probably, I think it's pushed all the way forward. Crowbar. Come on, you're a mechanic, aren't you? Crowbar. Crowbar. <laughs> Can't even see in there. I think you got pushed down. Nope. Like, oh, there it is. All right, lift it. Oh. Hey, 
my little girly hands. Yeah. All right. Fingers. Oh, the battery's floating. That's good. <laughs> Everything on this thing is bad. Okay, we'll just leave it there. Okay. Okay. Battery's there. Yeah. Throw her on. Purple goes on purple. Yeah. Red on black, black on red. You got it? Yeah, yeah. I'm not even holding it. Oh. <laughs> Yeah, everything on these vehicles usually falls off before or after. All right. Cranker. Cranker. I, need, I can't even get in this thing. Freaking steel everywhere. <laughs> She's alive. Barely. Just leave that on there. Yeah. <laughs> uh. This thing is hurting. <laughs> I can't shift. Slash, I can't move in here. I think she's. A... Yeah, this was this was the one with all the steel in the back. So, I know. Look, it folded the seat for her. Hold on. Let's see if I can shift her. Well, she still she still runs, but unfortunately. We can't shift, I can't move. And uh, yeah, there's no shift release, so. We won't worry about this one. But it is a Jeep, she still <laughs> runs. So all the Jeep fans out there, be happy. <laughs> Apparently the front tires are flat too. All right. Let's go have a race. Oh yeah, you just pull all the fuses. Start it. Fire away. All right. Whoop. We'll take this out first. So Thomas is taking the bent up race Suzuki. You're taking the two wheel drive F-150. We're gonna have a little race and then we're gonna jump. I wanna jump this today actually, if we can get it going. Make sure you put your seatbelt on. <laughs> oh yeah. See, he ain't scared. He knows how to drive these things. Usually most people come here and they're like, oh, I'm just gonna drive super slow. His mother like, taught him how to drive. Oh yeah. <laughs> hey, you gotta drive it like a rental. Why are you beating on it? It's not mine. Do a Rockford. He knows what a Rockford is. He's yeah. old enough. <laughs> <laughs> and we're gonna get dusted. <laughs> oh, this will be a fun race. Is everyone ready? <laughs> Apparently we're not doing American set go. <laughs> oh, what a view from up here. Just dusting the sun out. <laughs> the box just bounced. <laughs> <laughs> what a race. Sorry for the wind noise, it's very windy up here. I had to tell them to stop so they can have an actual start this time. If they even look up here. I think he just wants to do donuts. Oh, there we go. <laughs> Over the berm. I don't know if that thing's gonna last too long. <laughs> oh my god. 
so dusty. We need some rain. Uh-oh. Don't get hung up. Oh, he made it. That's funny. <laughs> he is wild. What kind of start was that? I didn't even say go. He just took off. <laughs> uh, that's funny. You cheated. I didn't I didn't even say go. You just left. <laughs> You're way too excited for that. I had to take advantage of the I, young guys. I see I that. He still beat you though. <laughs> yeah, look how dusty he is now. <laughs> I think he beat you fair and square. You should have seen the box just flexing on the side. I don't even think it's attached. Oh man, car parts everywhere. Oh, I saw that. Oh yeah, there's parts everywhere. All right, should we try and get that Pontiac going and see if we can? Uh... Let's do a big burnout with this thing first, actually. Um, Back, back it up to the front of that red car. There's a big old piece of plywood. You want to bring the Suzuki over? Sure. Here we go. Here comes Wild Dad again. <laughs> the old two wheel drive Fajor. <laughs> That's Suzuki. It's quite a weapon. All right, let's see if we can do a big burnout. Nice message for Brad there. He's off. All right, let's see if this is lined up correctly. Keep, yeah, just ram her. There you go. Do it in reverse. You might want to shut your window though. Turn the vent off. You might get smoked out. All right, let's see if this works or just pulls the plywood out. Oh yeah. Was awesome. <laughs> pull her, pull her forward a little bit. <laughs> and for race, <laughs> oh, burn right through it. How's that? You get a little smoke in there? Oh yeah. A little smoky. Still a little smoky in there. Uh, thank you. Oops. Looks like the box is on fire. <laughs> <laughs> so much smoke in here. Some yeah. Whew. Oh yeah, fresh tires. There you go. Burn these ones off, put some freshies on. <laughs> yeah, will they fit on the Honda? Look at those things, they're in good shape. Yeah, I know, they're like brand new. Just new enough to burn off. <laughs> yeah, fresh. Oh, you should see, like, that's where the box hit. Like, it was bouncing hard. I don't even think this thing's, no. Thing... Oh, really? Yeah. It's just bouncing around. It's a lot rougher than the Suzuki. Yeah. I think we should try and start the Pontiac. It's jumping time. Let's do her. So we meet again. So we're gonna try and get this thing going again. She didn't, she started last time, but didn't want to stay running. I think it's out of gas, but I think she's got some hope left there. Hopefully. So just hit the power button and then hold down that, uh, nope. nope. Hit yeah, the white one. Fuses. Yeah. And then hold down the red one. Nope. Let go of the white one. Press it again. No, the white one. Until it turns on. I killed it! You got this. I believe in you. Hold. There you go. Now hold down the red one. Until it clicks. Quick. What, what fuse right. do you have to pull? There we go. I don't know. <laughs> Start yanking on them. Need a better connection. Red, red. Black, black. Come on, car. All right. <laughs> oh, as I took him off. I wonder if she'll 
I know the one connection's a little loose. I think they're all loose. <laughs> I'm just gonna let it charge for a minute. I'm gonna go set everything up and then we'll figure it out from there. <laughs> the monkey will figure it out. Oh no! I <laughs> won't you stay running? Any ideas? No. Could make a better one. <laughs> I do actually. Start, start again. Ready? We are struggling, so the car's dead, unfortunately, and uh, obviously I don't want to leave the NOCO inside of it. Sorry for the beeping. I don't know. This car is just, I don't know, I'm see blah, blah. Anyway, so we tried to take the battery out of the Jeep. It's the wrong size. So we're trying to take the battery out of the Saturn, but we can't find the trunk release. So I've got my Sawzall, and I'm going to cut it open, and because apparently the battery's in the trunk or under the seat. But. I think it's in the truck, so hopefully we can get it. Um, <laughs> I took my seat off. I know. It's a recliner. Get in there. <laughs> Holy. You can cut through foam really well. Yeah. I think there's a I think there's a pin right here. Cut, cut right here. You want to just cut the pin right off? Yeah, there was a pin right in the corner there. I should probably put a metal, metal blade on that. I'm thinking that thing. Yeah. the trunk <laughs> uh, and it doesn't have a trunk release oh yeah it's way back there all right i got it guys oh you're skinny yeah i'm small I'm the smallest guy here how many mcdonald's did you have before you come here <laughs> that was the other day all right. hello <laughs> Tell me, see this is what i was pulling on Oh, that? Oh, that's where the release is. Oh, all right, we're good. No, there's no freaking battery oh, in the here. there's a battery. Be... Got a free jack stand. Holy shit, this thing is in here. All right, we're down to the last idea. We took the battery out of the Cobalt, Chevy Cobalt. Yep. That was the half hour ordeal we had to cut the seat off as you guys saw and obviously it's the wrong one because that one put screws in that one clamps the top so this is what we've come down to i approve you guys approve you approve oh well, what are we looking at let's start it oh he's down this is the most professional way to do it <laughs> uh. Oh, you didn't even have this one on. Oh, it's not on? Yeah, that's right. Come on, girl. But you go dying on me now. We're back. All right. Yeah, one try. Let's it. jump this. Yeah, one opportunity. Mom's spaghetti. Let's jump it. All right, this thing, the hood's open. Hopefully, hopefully this thing flies, hits the Jeep or the Cobalt. Doesn't matter. It took us about almost two hours to get that thing going.
is a beauty. Oh, look at the battery. Oh, oh, I don't think we got another one going. Look at that. <laughs> uh, the worst part about car jumps is I never Can't get see. to actually see them jump. Yeah, I know it. Oh my god, look at this battery. Wow. Man, that hit hard. It's brutal. So what happened? I just got bounced. It turned. It came up and bounced, and then it dusted, and it just spun around. It turned backwards. last second. Yeah, I saw. Whew. I mean, I know it won't start again with that. <laughs> yeah. Here, but I wonder if we got another chance. Found the GoPro. <laughs> Something's burning in there. Airbag is broken. Can't breathe. <clears throat> well, what do you think of that? That's good. Well, yeah. I mean, I don't even know what happened. <laughs> I'm going off what you guys saw. <laughs> Wait till you see the, the, the video. <laughs> oh, oh, man. man. The thing took a dinger for sure. She looks like she front end hit pretty hard. No air conditioning. Back end looks fine. I don't know how it's backwards, but we'll review the game tape later. Huh, well, what do you think? A good jump. Not a bad birthday? No, it's a good birthday. Good birthday. <laughs> good, good day. Good day. Cool. Well, I don't think we're going to try and jump it again tonight. I have a feeling that it's not going to. I mean, we can try and start it. If you want to go grab the Suzuki, we can try and start it. Okay, the key's on the uh, tailgate there. But, oh, well, there you go. He's taking it home. <laughs> Look what I got, Mom. Monkey, you still doing good? Both airbags. Well, I'm glad the monkey was fine. GoPro ended up in his crotch, so we'll review that game tape later, too. Yeah, it was weird. It was going straight down, picking up lots of lots of speed and then last second it just kind of turned towards you actually so i don't know what your footage look like but she was flying pretty good drone all right we'll wait for the uh we'll wait for the suzuki here and see if we can boost it again all right what's uh what are her bets here i think it'll start i don't know if it'll go anywhere she's still kind of attached it looks like Oh, Holy. who put the battery there? <laughs> All right. Whoa, you got spark. Oh. Look, at lights are on. Go start her. Start it. Let's see. If it starts. We might be running out of battery. Just throw it on the roof. I think it'll start. I think so. Oh, put it in drive. Hold your foot on the brake, though. Is it going to move? It's in drive? Put it in first? No, I think we snapped everything. Hold it wide open. to the floor oh the floor got pushed back that's why <laughs> the floor is all pushed back <laughs> 145 well we tried. It starts. They all seem to start after. This don't go anywhere. That one kind of starts. That one runs well, but the axles are snapped. 
Someone's like, you should save the axles and then put new ones in. There you go. Yeah, we'll just put her on the yeah, hoist. Tires. We'll yeah. just put the hoist yeah. up and uh, you know, change all the axles, tranny. What, what else you need down here? We got spare tires. Yeah, we no got problem. spare tires. So, tires. anyways, we'll wrap this one up for now. We got quite a little pile going. I can't believe we didn't even. It didn't even hit that car either. Or the Jeep, yeah, or the minivan that was on top last time. Anyway, thank you guys for watching. Happy birthday, Thomas. Don't do anything we wouldn't do. If you have any cars you want to see jumped, bring them over or let us know in the suggestions. And uh, yeah, have a fantastic week and weekend. Thank you guys for coming out. We'll see you later. See you. <laughs>